Frank C. Man. Welcome back to the episode with the man Frank C. Uh, today I'm going to talk about uh, fragrance, actually, more of a comparison uh, between a, um, I think at this point it's pretty much like a holiday, wintertime staple. But first, if this is your first time on the channel, please consider subscribing as we continue to bring you fragrance news and reviews you can use in your everyday fragrance journey. Um, if this is your first time on the channel, please consider subscribing. And to all of my current subscribers, I definitely appreciate your support. Let's get back into it. Um, today we're going to be comparing for the House of Burberry, the Burberry Hero line. Um, it's Burberry EDT and Burberry EDP. Now, I received Burberry EDT as a 2021, 2021 release. I, I received this as a Christmas gift in 2021. And then I received this as a Christmas gift in 2022. So starting with Burberry Hero. Burberry Hero has notes of bergamot, juniper, black pepper, and there's three kinds of cedar in this. Atlas cedar, Virginia cedar, and Himalayan cedar. So it's a very woody scent. Uh, it's kind of uh, peppery. It's peppery. It reminds me, just a little reminder spray here. It reminds me a lot uh, of a scent from Davidoff called Horizon. Uh, came out back, most like back in like maybe like 2008, 2009, 10 era, so somewhere somewhere in there. It's kind of it's kind of um, citrusy because of the bergamot, and um, it's, it's, it is very woody because of the three types of cedar in here. So it reminds me a lot of that. So I know when I first smelled it last year, I said, "Man, this smells a lot like uh, Horizon." Uh, uh, I'm sorry, Horizon by Davidoff. So. To me, this is okay. I mean, I, I don't get too much um, staying power out of this. Uh, I might get maybe like two, two to three hours out of it, and then it's gone. It, 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 I never really thought of it as anything kind of special in that regard. So, that's Burberry EDT. Now, enter uh, 2022. This release is Burberry EDP. Um, of course, the darker bottle. You know, you, a lot of times when these companies come out, you know, they come out with. Uh, you know, different tinted bottle, kind of, you know, the note that is heavier, that it might be more lasting power to it. Burberry Hero EDP, uh, this one has notes of, similar notes also, but it's some additions to it. Um, it's Pine Needles, Olibottom, Benzoin, which is really nice, Incense, which is really nice, Atlas Cedar, Himalayan Cedar, and Virginia Cedar at the base. So the same base notes, so the three different kinds of cedars, that's in Himalaya, I'm not sorry, Himalaya, and Burberry Hero EDP as well. But that incense, the Oli Bottom, definitely gives it in that um, pine needles are still there, but that incense, the Oli Bottom, uh, and benzoin really gives it a nice uh, backbone. Like it's, um, it's a lot stronger than um, the, the original, and it, it's deeper too. It's deeper. Yeah, it's, it's deeper. There. Really, the incense really gives it. Um, it really gives a nice, um, you know, uh, some oomph to it. it. It makes it a lot, um, a lot stronger than the EDT. And I get a lot, a lot more lasting power out of, out of the EDP than the EDT. Um, you know, both have magnetic caps. You know, well, slightly magnetic. Smack, snap in place. Um, the Burberry, Burberry EDP is um, it's a lot darker, deeper, more rich. Uh, that benzoin and, and, and incense, I think, was, was, was what was needed for this one. So this one, to me, is kind of generic. Uh, like I said, it reminds me a lot of, a, of, a, of the Davidoff scent, uh, Horizon, that came out back in like 2010 time frame. I don't, I don't, I don't think, yeah, I think it's kind of generic, a little dated. But um, with the Burberry EDP, they, they really did a good job of updating it, making it stronger. Uh, you know, I get like eight to ten hours out of this one. It's just lasts a whole work day. I've worn it um, several times since I got I received it for Christmas, and um, yeah, it, it's 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 definitely an improvement over this one. I, 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 I you know, when it comes down to it, my favorite would, would be the Burberry EDP Hero, and if you don't have Burberry EDT or you're not a collector, you, you just want to uh, you know you just want to smell good pretty much, I would definitely go with the uh, the EDP, and not even consider the, the EDT. Um, you know, just. Um, you know, speaking from a genuine standpoint, uh, the EDP is, is more rich, is dark, is, is darker, is heavier. Uh, well, I like deep, darker, heavy, heavy scents. Uh, that's, that's another thing. Maybe if you're a beginner, you go go with this one. You, you, you kind of really get into the sense. You might be a younger guy. 
I might go good with this, but I say if you're 25 and up, more or less, um, I would say definitely go with the EDP, especially if you don't have the EDTM collection. Uh, either one of these, I think, are, are good for um, you know any any season, any reason. Um, I haven't worn either one of these, and uh, um, definitely, definitely worth uh, uh, checking out. And I will see. You, I, and with me, I, I, I prefer the EDP over EDT. At the end of the day, I think it's a better value, uh, smells better, lasts longer, more more powerful. Pretty good. That's all I have for you. The next time, take care.